Hey guys, so last time was an improvement, but we're we're gonna give it another shot. I think I can get something better this time. So 60 degrees above the horizon going over that way with the big dog again. And we're actually back at our like premier spot again. So it's pretty dark here. Um, more importantly, this time I'm giving the scope tons and tons of time to acclimate to the temperature here, uh, which I found might have been an issue last time as well as uh, we're in this darker area. It's a little more remote, so there's no like big heat sinks around here So there's hopefully gonna be less turbulence. The weather like looks okay, but we'll have to see so Everything is set up now all that's left to do is wait And here she comes Yeah, you can see way more detail in this one compared to the last one. Uh, that's, I guess, the difference that 60 degrees makes compared to 30, um, which I'm still waiting for like a perfect pass over like 90, but those are hard to come by. So anyways, if we look at our best frame here and compare it with the rendering of the ISS, you can see the solar panels and everything on each side, and you can see the radiators. You can actually even see little segmentations on the radiators, which I was really excited about. And of course, there's the main internal truss structure and everything. Um, major improvements over last time. Still looking to keep on making some in the future, but we'll probably get on to some nebula stuff or maybe some galaxy stuff in the next video. So hope that was entertaining for you guys. Thanks for watching.